all right so what's going on guys i am back with a brand new video and in today's video i will be showing you how to import 4k video into adobe premiere pro and export it back to 4k now a little bit of context here i have made this video back in 2018 but off late i was starting to see comments bruh, of people bruh, stating bruh, that they're having bruh, issues when they're trying bruh, to import bruh. 4k video into adobe premiere pro so first off on my desktop i have a 4k video and to prove to you that it's really 4K under details, you'll see that it's 3840 by 2160 pixels. So it's really 4K and it's 60 FPS. So it's 4K 60. Now that I've got that out of the way, I'll click on OK and I'm just going to open Adobe Premiere Pro. And I'm going to create a new project. And for the sake of this video, let's call it 4K and click OK. Now that I've created a new project in Adobe Premiere Pro, I want to import the 4K video. Now this is the simplest part of this tutorial. So you just drag and drop that 4K video on your desktop or wherever it is, just drag and drop it from wherever it is into your timeline. And boom, you have imported the 4K video into Adobe Premiere Pro. Now that you've imported it, you want to edit it and export it back to 4K, right? So again, it's very, very simple. So you click on file, export media. And now this window will open up. Now you'll see these two options called output and source. You'll want to focus on these two options for this video. Now uh, under format, you'll want to select H.264 and under preset, you'll want to select math source high bitrate. Make sure these two things are selected H.264 and math source high bitrate. And under source, now you'll see 3840 by 2160, 4K, and it's 60 FPS. So the original video is 4K 60 and it's exporting back to 4K 60. And it's that simple. Click on export, and that's how you export it back to 4K 60 FPS. But what if you wanted to export it to 4K 30 instead? It's again very simple. You click on sequence, sequence settings. And now you, under sequence settings, you'll see this option called time base. At the side of time base, instead of it being 60 frames per second, you just have to select 30 frames per second and hit OK. After selecting that, go to file, export, media. And now you'll see the source of the video has changed to 3840 by 2160 and 30 FPS. So it's 4K 30 and it's exporting to 4K 30. It's that simple. So I hope this video helped you guys and cleared any doubts or issues you might have had previously with Adobe Premiere Pro when you try to import and export 4K video. If this video did help you, don't forget to leave it a like and perhaps even subscribe. And if you have any queries, do let me know down in the comment section below. I'll try my best to answer as many queries as possible. And until next time, guys, peace out.